Hey guys, it's Candice and in today's QuickBooks Tips and Tricks, I want to show you if you've deleted a transaction and you want to be able to find it, how do you do that in QuickBooks Online? So you're going to go over to the gear, go over to tools and click on audit log. Then you're going to go over to the filter to make it easiest. You can either do it by pick the user if you want. You can pick a time frame if you're looking for a specific transaction. Then you're going to go under transactions on the left and then you're going to drop this down and you're going to pick deleted or voided transactions and then you can choose it by a specific account if you want and then you're going to click apply and anything that's been voided in the system is going to show up then over here you're going to click view when you find the one you're looking for and you're going to see what's happened and if you click show all to the right it will give you all the transactions that happened. You can look at it. And then if it's not been re-added, so here it was added and then it was deleted on the 19th. So April 17th, it was added. April 19th, it was deleted. Then you would look at the transaction and to be able to add it back, you can't just do undo, but what you can do is see what the transaction detail was. And then you need to go back up to the plus and add whatever the transaction is that was deleted, whether it was an invoice, a payment, a check, whatever the transaction was that you deleted, you need to recreate it now if you actually needed it in there and it was a mistake. All right. I hope you guys enjoyed this tip. Don't forget to subscribe. If you need help with QuickBooks, feel free to check out Confidence with QuickBooks, my online course that takes you from the beginning to the end. If you're a brand new user or you've been trying to figure out QuickBooks, but you've really been struggling trying to do it on your own, the course does come with support. So you can ask me questions and I answer them inside of the course as well as if you enjoyed this tip and you'd like to receive them in your inbox, feel free to go up above or down below and join with your email and I'll send them directly to you. And if you need help cleaning up your QuickBooks or fixing something and you want more of a private session, you don't need the full course, feel free to check out up above or down below. I'll have a link for my private sessions. Have an amazing day. I look forward to seeing you guys in the next tip. Bye-bye.